Hello everyone, welcome back to Minecraft with me, Mr. Fox, and today I am in the cruise ship. Now, I just want to quickly address something. Now, this is not how the cruise ship looked about an hour ago, because I just spent the last 40 minutes or so doing this on video, but the video got deleted. So, I'm going to walk you through and show you the cruise ship first, and then I'm going to continue working on the cruise ship with you guys. With you people. So, look outside first. Yes, let go outside. Now, there is a day ticker up there now, so I can't do the sunset thing. Which is just hilarious. I would say I got an image of it, but no, I didn't. Anyway, this is how my cruise ship looks. I didn't use any tutorials. I didn't use anything else besides one image of how a cruise ship, how a cruise ship looks. Why did that sound wrong originally? It's called the SS Conquest, and I love it very, very much. And today I'm going to be trying to interiorize it for the first time in many years. It's a very old ship, because it's been here since like, what, 2017? Yeah, 2017. It's got some sports up there. It's got a pool, mini pool right there. Could probably do with like a larger one now that I actually look at it. And I love it very much. I believe when I first built it, there was a farm with the front. But then I was playing with someone and they fixed it. So that was fun. And where are they now, Mr. Fox? Just gone. Okay, so let's... This is the cabin, by the way. Now, let's go back to the point... I did record, but I accidentally prioritized taking a photo to send to my friend. Which I didn't even send to my friend, because I realized, oh, he won't care. Um, so I did that, and I very quickly just realized I didn't save the clip. And it was a very cool clip. I'm going to stop talking about it right now. Okay, so, my idea here is I want to merge the theater, the restaurant, the library, the lounge, all together in one. Theater, restaurant, library, lounge. All together in one. Now, you're probably thinking, oh my gosh, that's so crazy, wow. Uh, but it actually kind of isn't that crazy. So, my idea is to have all rooms end with a balcony. So they can all look down and see what's going on. Some room, some floors will be able to go down, you know, and mingle. But some floors will only have a balcony, and that's it. There will only be stairs going to special areas from here but people will only be able to go down there with the first class or the second class or whatever the like the highest tier which is actually here and not here but yeah it's a good yeah i just i'm just ready for the fact that the rooms i set out these rooms down here they're just gonna burst through this floor. This floor is not gonna get any love. Or this lo this floor is not gonna get any love. Basically, there's a floor. Sometime, we'll just not get any love. This might just end up being a walkway. Because, due to the lowness of here, and due to the height of these rooms, let's actually go and see how tall they are. They're nine. Yeah, so they're they're gonna go bursting through. Now the question is Is that gonna I think I wanna do it here. I think. And even if I have it wrong, I can just Move it down. Oh gosh, I have it horribly wrong. Oh 
Okay, how's that gonna place? Perfect. Absolutely perfect. Let me remove these blocks. Yeah. So, one thing you don't want to do is get rid of this, because that's telling you where the next one needs to go. So that's where the next one needs to go? An entire block to... high. <sighs> How does that happen? Please tell me. I pick block, this block, and I get this. Good job, Minecraft. Good job. Good, good job, Minecraft. Good job. Are you trying to text? <laughs> I I love that about messaging people is when you see them messaging, <laughs> and they just take a while, and you're like, I wonder what they're messaging. And one time, one thing I really love is when they're done messaging and they just. It's just the most random, pointless thing. <laughs> uh, it makes you both really annoyed, but also, like, makes you laugh. So I like it. Text your friends. Oh. One thing we gotta remember is to follow through with this wall technique. Or wall design up technique. Okay, um, just to make it all look nice and fancy. Hello everyone, welcome back to Minecraft with me, Mr. Fox. And today, we're back in the cruise ship. Now, as you know, I always do my intro when I'm coming back. Because I forgot that I'm in the middle of a video, not the start of a video. But wouldn't it be handy if I knew, or if I didn't know, that I was actually on a second episode, and I did my intro just without meaning to. That'd be funny. So, we're working on this second part here, and basically, I want to change how the ship looks. So you see all of that? That's going to have big windows. There's going to be a big theater stage right down here, right where this ends. I counted, I didn't even count five. Okay. So we're gonna have this going around here. Let me just snap my fingers and do that. This wood will probably not become grey concrete, like grey concrete. For the simple reason that I've already used it. And using it again would be kind of bland. So we're going to be trying to look for a nice block that we can use in just a moment. <sighs> okay. Okay. So, this is the center point. We'll probably have the restaurant and the something else under there then under here we'll have the restaurant down here this is the back and there's gonna be some lawn chairs there so at a certain point this theater will end right, I'll probably go from the theater into the lounge So then this will probably be the lounge and maybe another restaurant. So restaurant at the front, restaurant at the back. Did that the wrong way around, but you get it anyway. Then there will have to be a ginormous ceiling put onto this place. Probably will go with the same, or maybe a yellow terracotta. Now, so let's get some stairs. We're going to go with white. that as the center block. No, actually, no, 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 no. Let's go way fancier. 
or try to go by fancier. Okay. Yeah, so we shouldn't use a ceiling block as a floor. And let's try and stay away from checkered pattern. We're making things more difficult for ourselves. Yeah, let's go with this block. It's a bit plain, but it kind of leaves all of this up to being imagined as something beautiful. Now, let's work on this. Now, it might occur to you that I don't actually know what kind of spot I'm working on. I'm just working on everything at once, which is probably a bad idea, but I'm I'm kind of known for doing that. You know, I try to concern myself with everything. I like, to, I like how well that worked out in college. Oh, fucking hell. I only didn't do anything because I was actually expecting to learn stuff in class. But no! It was fucking... Oh, it, was, it was just a disgrace. I didn't learn any new fancy words to make me sound fancy. Like I didn't get to go home and be like, Oh, mother, I learned a new word today. I didn't get to watch an example video or film. And I get to understand like how it was made. It just didn't, it felt shit. 250 or down the fucking drain. I would say if I didn't get money back. Basically, in there, you're actually not even, like, properly losing money. You're only just... Um... Lending money? But the more you stay in there, then you can make that money back. So it's kind of handy. Stay in there for two months, make your money back. Do something else. It's just rubbish, and I don't think I'll ever do it again. Nor would I recommend it to anyone. Also, what's also surprising is I would never actually say I oh, don't do that to anyone. So if you want to do it, then they can do it. I won't have to do it. So yeah, and it'd also be nice, like if they did it and then they came out with the same sort of responses that I did. So that would kind of comfort me. Any hoozles. I would kind of like to hook those chimneys up to something. That would probably mean, if you did want to do that, you'd probably have to bring that down and then that would be like a grand staircase or something. Like, we'd have to walk around it. And if this was an actual cruise ship where we could actually feel stuff, it'd be a very warm cruise ship when you're walking around this stair. Do you want to try that, like, actually? I mean, I don't know how cruise ships work, to be honest. But I'm guessing there's a certain room in the cruise ship that you can do stuff in, but it's also... You know, one of those. Do you actually want to do that? Because it might ruin everything. So I personally, hi, hello, will be doing this pipe all the way from the boiler room up to the big pipe, and it'll be exhausting. I might even remove the glowstone. That's the sort of degree I'm going to. Well, the next question... Yeah, that helped. The next question is... Is that going to be my centerpiece? I know you're probably thinking, what? How can that be your centerpiece? Well, just... Let me play around. Okay, so we got this really nice feeling going on here. 
and you know it just feels like a nice centerpiece to me anyway so get some more dark oak as much as I'd love to say there is like a whole lot we can do there just isn't so if we try to do Something like this. Like that? No, then there's... <laughs> no point having a glass there if you can't see through. So I came up with something for this room. It was kind of that I thought that I was thinking earlier anyway. So, on the blue deck, I mean, which is the highest deck, which actually isn't, I mean, with sleeping quarters, I mean, we could put some back here, but they'd be very low tier. Doesn't really stop us, because like, we do this, we do a bit of that, but then this is kind of all you're getting, you're not getting a premium height. But you know what? Yeah, let, let's do it. How big are these? Four? Four. Um. They're mostly long. And large. Unless. I should remember the top tier is supposed to be top tier. <laughs> like the highest point of the ship is supposed to be the best tier. So, so I'm not making them really small. I'm making them really big. Okay. So we'll have the largest rooms in here. Um, let's... Otherwise, it looks too small and too silly. So, like that. Uh, we'll put the yellow ceiling into here. Decorate the rooms the way we need them to be. One, two, three. One, two, three. And then. This is the captain's quarters, which we'll definitely have to get to in another episode. I can feel this being split into many episodes. I can. Maybe, I don't know. Well, I'm not doubting myself, I just... I'm expecting this. So, if we throw down this light blue ceiling... So, this is the room that we have. It feels very cozy in here. Or is that just me? I actually would love to stay on this top floor. <laughs> and there was I being like, oh no, it's too small. Plenty of room. Well, we'll put up the walls next time, maybe. So let's review what we've done in this episode. So, we have done these lower tier rooms, which are actually very nice, and all rooms are going to follow this same sort of feeling. That's because we value equality over people. So no matter how much they pay for a room, whatever they're getting will be nice. Okay. 
Okay, so... Oh, yeah, let's actually review what we did. Because I don't think I did it properly. Let's... Yeah, let's do it properly. I'll try not to be too long. Okay, so we got this main room right here. With these lovely rooms. They're the exact same for everyone. Lovely brown bread. Brown beds. Then we got these pipes. That actually lead up to the main chimney. Chimney, not chimney. Oh, I don't know what a chimney is. Now, this is where we'll be working on in the next episode. As you can see, it's dark and pointless. More rooms. And then this is the highest tier. You can see the rooms are definitely much larger. So pay a bit of a pretty penny and then you'll be able to gain access to this lovely lounge up here. There'll be another lounge down there. Um, then there'll be... Probably another staircase right up here. You see, then we... Then. There. I think that kind of... Sorry, I'm kind of trying to build no hut. There. That to me kind of looks good. That looks good. That looks like it's being held up. And you can go around and be all polite and stuff. And yes, you can see the fences, but whatever. Yeah, so that's it for me today. I'll try and take the most pleasing shot. Um, yeah. So thank you very much for watching. I'll time this perfectly now. Or I suppose my editor himself can get the image. Is that a hole or a door over there? I think it's a hole.